everyone. Welcome to my food blog, where I share my passion for all things delicious and authentic. Today, I'm going to tell you about my recent visit to an amazing restaurant that serves some of the most amazing dishes. It's in a cafe shop setting so prices are reasonable. It's a great place for a family outing or celebration. The restaurant is called Kiansen Seafood Restaurant, and it's located at Angamokyo. The staff are friendly and attentive, and the menu is extensive and tempting. I went there with a family to celebrate my father's birthday, and we decided to order some of their specialties. We started with shark's fin soup, a delicacy that is rich and flavorful, with a silky texture and a hint of vinegar. The soup was served in a large bowl, with pieces of shark's fin, crab meat, and mushrooms floating in it. It was a warm and comforting dish, perfect for a cold day. Next, we had steamed grouper, a whole fish that was cooked to perfection, with tender and flaky flesh and a crispy skin. The fish was seasoned with ginger, scallions, soy sauce, and rice wine. The fish was so fresh and moist, and the sauce was light and savory. We enjoyed it with some steamed rice, and it was a satisfying and healthy dish. Then, we had suckling pig, a roasted young pig that was crispy on the outside and juicy on the inside. The pig was cut into bite-sized pieces, and it was served with a sweet and tangy plum sauce. The pig was so succulent and flavorful, and the sauce was a perfect complement. We couldn't get enough of it, and it was definitely the highlight of the meal. Next, we had black pepper crab, a spicy and aromatic dish that made our mouths water. The crab was stir-fried with black pepper, garlic, butter. The crab was meaty and tender, and the sauce was thick and spicy. We loved the contrast between the sweet crab and the peppery sauce, and we ate it with our hands, getting messy and happy. Finally, we had Buddha jump over the wall, a soup that is said to be so delicious that even Buddha would jump over the wall to taste it. The soup was made with various ingredients, such as abalone, sea cucumber, scallops, mushrooms, chicken, ham, and herbs. The soup was simmered for hours, and it was served in a ceramic pot. The soup was rich and complex, with a deep and fragrant flavor. It was a luxurious and indulgent dish, and we felt like royalty. To end our meal, we had longevity fried noodles, a simple but satisfying dish that was stir-fried with eggs, bean sprouts, scallions, and soy sauce. The noodles were chewy and crispy, and they were a great way to fill up our stomachs. We also had some jasmine tea, which was refreshing and soothing. We had a wonderful time at Kiansang, and we were impressed by the quality and variety of the food. The portions were generous, the prices were reasonable, and the service was excellent. We left the restaurant feeling full and happy, and we can't wait to go back again. If you're looking for a place to enjoy authentic and delicious seafood cuisine with family and friends whether for birthday celebration or just a dinner out with friends, I highly recommend Kian Seng. You won't regret it. Trust me, it's worth it. Thank you for reading my food blog, and I hope you enjoyed this post. If you did, please like, comment, and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to my blog for more food adventures. Until next time, happy eating!